Devari Hayamim Shani, 2 Chronicles 14. So Aviahu slept with his fathers, and they buried him in the city of David. And Acha, his son, reigned in his stead. In his days, the land was quiet ten years. And Acha did that which was good and right in the eyes of Yahuwah Eloheinu, rather, Yahuwah Eloheinu. For he took away at the altars of the strange Elohim and the high places, and broke down at the images, and cut down at the Asherah poles, and commanded Yahuda to seek at Yahuwah Elohai of their fathers, and to do the Torah and the commandment. Also he took away out of all the cities of Yahudah at the high places and at the images. And the kingdom was quiet before him. And he built fenced cities in Yahudah, for the land had rest. And he had no war in those years, because Yahuwah had given him rest. Therefore he said unto Yahuda, Let us build at these cities, and make about them walls, and towers, gates, and bars, while the land is yet before us. Because we have sought at Yahuwah Eloheinu, we have sought him, and he has given us rest on every side. So they built and prospered. And Acha had an army of men that bore targets and spears, out of Yahuda three hundred thousand, and out of Binyamin that bore shields and drew bows, two hundred and fourscore thousand. All these were mighty men of valor. And there came out against them Zarach the Cushi, with a host of a thousand thousand and three hundred chariots, and came unto Marasha. Then Acha went out against him, and they set the battle in array in the valley of Sephatha at Marasha. And Acha cried unto El Yahweh, Eloheyu, and said, Yahweh, it is nothing with you to help, whether with many or with them that have no power. Help us, O Yahweh, Eloheyu, for we rest on you, and in your name we go against this multitude. O Yahweh, you are our Elohim. Let not man prevail against you. So Yahuwah smote at the Kushim before Acha and built Yahuda. And the Kushim fled. And Acha and the people that were with him pursued them unto Girar, and the Kushim were overthrown. But they could not recover themselves, for they were destroyed before Yahuwah and before his host, and they carried away very much spoil. And they smote at all the cities round about Girar, for the fear of Yahuwah came upon them. And they spoiled at all the cities, for there was exceeding much spoil in them. They smote also the tents of cattle, and carried away sheep and camels in abundance, and returned to Yerushalayim.